At Yellow, we've been hard at work. This morning, trucking company Yellow is in the red. After years of financial struggles, the nearly century-old business with 30,000 workers has reportedly shut down. The company has more than 12,000 trucks and a long list of customers, including Walmart and Home Depot. We have the team, the tech, and the trucks to get it done. Analysts say the shutdown will likely mean higher delivery prices passed on to consumers as other firms try to handle the extra load. Yellow had accumulated more than $1 billion in debt and got a $700 million COVID rescue loan from the government in 2020 when its role in the supply chain was deemed essential to national security. Its financial woes compounded by tensions with the Teamsters Union. Surely, Teamsters leaders don't want their members or employees to lose their jobs. Meanwhile, more challenging news for the trucking industry and all drivers. Gas prices are on the rise, up 16 cents in the last week, to a national average of 3.75 per gallon, the highest since November due to oil production cuts overseas and refinery issues blamed on the record heat this summer. As for Yellow Trucking Company, it claimed the Teamsters were blocking plans to modernize the company. The union blamed decades of mismanagement for the company's troubles. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.